Welcome to the new new 19 Vikings. I'm Joseph Music. And I'm Yuri Yang. I hope you had a good week without us. In our new broadcast, you will see sports, weather, and much more News 19. Wednesday the 21st is a minimum day, and the following Thursday and Friday is a non-attendance day. Sports is a transitional period, and theater just finished their fall production. Have a great week, Vikings, and now a settlement on tutoring. This is little Timmy. He's having trouble in math. Shall we take a look? Oh, little Timmy, what are you doing? I'm doing all this math homework, and it's just so hard. Oh, really? Maybe you should try tutoring. What's that? Well, Timmy, tutoring is a wonderful service offered every eighth period in B209 where real students, like you, help you to do all of your math needs, including preparing for a test, homework, and any other questions you may have. Welcome back to Sports Corner, Vikings. I'm Nicholas Nunez. This Friday, boys' varsity soccer game is against N. Gregory. Boys basketball is in, uh, against uh, Central Valley, and the girls basketball is again, facing off with uh, Hewson. And good luck to all our athletes. Now to the segment of our water polo team. Water polo is a very complicated sport. Yeah, it's pretty complicated. You have to do a lot of stuff to not die. Why did you choose water polo over football and other such sports? Because uh, water polo seemed uh, like a better sport and, uh, and uh, you get pretty ripped. Would you say that you struggled for the first year? Yes, absolutely. And, is that because you got unfit? Would you say that you've gotten stronger? Absolutely. Yeah, water polo gets you, it's all nice small. I'm with Colin here on the Johansson varsity water polo team. Colin, would you say that with being on the varsity team, yes. would you say that would be intense? Uh, yes, the team, uh, or at least the games are. Uh, definitely during tournaments and stuff, it's a little hard. Um, we just we just get so pumped up, it's hard to keep the intensity down. Would you say the tournaments are the best part of water polo? Definitely. We get to actually challenge ourselves. I, I just say that we have an overall more fun time in tournaments. Yeah, especially JV tournaments, those are fun. All right. Thank you, Colin. to ask him a few questions too. Would you say that you have struggled for your first year of water polo? Oh, definitely, yeah. Like, I didn't know how to egg beater, I didn't want to start, fresh. Could you say that you've gotten stronger? Oh, okay. yeah, I could egg beater. I could do a warm-up without stop breathing, you know? I'm here with the girls' water polo team too. Bianca, would you have said that for your first year, did you get stronger and did you have fun? Definitely, I definitely started off a little rough with never playing a sport like this. Water polo is a lot harder than you think, and I think it was definitely a fun year with all my teammates. I'm here with Natalie on the girls' water polo team too. Natalie, would you say as a goalie, would you say that would be a harder position to play than any other position in water polo? Yes, polo team. Shelby, would you say that water polo is very intense when you're in the pool? Uh, yes, I'd say water polo is very intense. Welcome to your handsome weather report. My name is Stormy Keeper-Teller. Here to report your daily weather forecast from November 15th to Tuesday the 13th. Today's high is 70 degrees and tomorrow's high will be 70. 
Monday the high will be 66 degrees and Tuesday will be 66 degrees. That's it for Joho Weather Report. My name is Sorby Kiru Teller. Now it's the birthday time. Welcome to back Welcome back to Birthday Time, Vikings. I'm Riley Tolleson. Now to this week's birthdays. Happy birthday to you all. Now to ask a Viking. I'm Marcus Pollard and this is Viking TV. What do you think about the football homecoming and could it have been better? I feel like there could be more advertising for the homecoming because like it wasn't a big thing that I knew about. Uh, second question, what do you like about the rallies and should we have more? Uh, I think we should have more rallies. Uh, I like how like each group gets involved and really gets hyped for the like stuff we do, like the games. What do you like most about Johansson? I like that my mom works here. Her name's Pontes. Shout out to Pontes. And I can see that you're a link leader, so I want to ask, what do you think about the link crew? They're great. All the people are great. They're pretty much all my friends, so yeah, they work hard for all the freshmen. And yeah. That's nice that you guys do that for the freshmen. For my last question, I'm gonna ask you and you can you can you can say whatever answer you want because he's gonna watch it, but what do you think about Mr. Shar? Mr. Shar is cool. Um he could be mean sometimes. No, I'm just kidding. Um no, he he's cool. He's a good what is he, a principal? He's a good principal. And he really helps out this school. Do you think we should get him on the show? Yes.